Just decided to make a quick little video on overclocking your Samsung Galaxy Player. Found two programs that work well together. One that I've already had. It's called Tegrat Overclock. And you can set your frequency from 1 gigahertz up to 1.3. And say I said it's 1.3. Confirm. Okay. Now I go to my CPU tuner. I already has set it, so when the battery is at a certain level it uses its performance mode and right now it's set to auto so it's on performance and it's running at 1300 megahertz and the minimum is 100 megahertz and so when the battery gets down to 15 percent it'll go down to oh yeah 100 megahertz at the most and let's go back to ooh, go back. Let's go back to normal with auto. Refresh it. Well, it's not showing me that's working, but you can see here showing me that it's going back up. Go to clock speeds. And also performance the way I have it set. Should show it in a second. There it goes. Most is 1300, 1300 megahertz and lowest is 100 megahertz. And it works well. That way you're not always not knowing what it's running so you're not overclocking it like 24 7. It's not going to really heat up. It's only at 18 degrees Celsius right now. So it's not hot at all. And I don't think there's anything to worry about if you overclock it using these two things because it's never always running at 1.3 megahertz or gigahertz, my bad um, and that's pretty much it really simple to use quick, easy, it's free and I really like it I'm going to be using that from now on That I know now that I know about it I forget what the username was on YouTube that brought it to my attention, but you can see some of the comments on one of my previous videos. This thing is called the Truth Agenda. Alright, well, thank you for watching.